hello everyone welcome back to my channel i hope you're doing well we are going to be reacting to coventry city versus luton town coventry they they needed to win to move themselves out the relegation zone and they won 3-2 luton of course had a slow start to life back in the championship looking to get at least the playoffs or hell even promotion at this rate so maybe it's a launch pad for coventry to actually push up the league table because i i predicted them second i'm thinking yeah okay cool so let's see what happens here i've actually watched the game so i'm gonna dissect how the game transpires so yeah let's do it Well, 17 months on from that fateful day at Wembley. Two teams we expected to see go on divergent paths. Luton Town into the sunlit uplands of the Premier League where they competed so well. And let's wholeheartedly and emphatically endorse Luton's message after Eli Adebayo suffered disgusting racial abuse during the week. Well, since Wembley, they've been into a major ongoing rebuild here at Coventry City. They're used to slow starts. They're used to uh, coming good in the end. This is Van Ewijk. Oh, absolutely oh. travelling. And Kaminsky's busy again. No, I don't mind that. His only real offer in the 18-yard box was Hadji Wright. They're not particularly well represented in there. And the space was there, the gap was on. It's only been lively enough in these opening eight minutes as Coventry seek to get on the front foot once more. Doughty. Oh, we. Aye, 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 aye. Nah, nah, nah. Mansell Chong, yeah? Get cooked. And then man see Alfie Doughty as well cooked. Cooks, bro. Nah, Sakamoto, bro. Saka, Saka, Sakamoto. I actually like, well, I actually like his ability, kinda. And then who was uh, who was that? Um, uh, wait, hold on. Who, who was that? I don't know who that was. Wait, hold on. Who's that? Who's that player? Was he cook Kun? He cook Chung? Wait, hold on. Wait, 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 hold on. Was that Sakamoto? Oh, I think I got it wrong. I think that was Sakamoto. Oh, no, my bad. Sakamoto cooked Chung. And then Milan just cooked Alfie Doughty. Oh, he ripped him to shreds, man. Hey. Oh. Thought he made the challenge. But then if I can step up. Oh, and oh. Right. Right, Chief. Well, they get a little bit of good fortune. There's been a really good start from Coventry in terms of this from Doughty. He feels that he's done his job. Fortunately, Ricochet and Sheep doesn't have a great deal to hit there. He's actually in front of the near post. He's desperately trying to wrap the right foot around it to feed it into the near corner. Doughty. Chong. Got a room for Kraus. Oh, 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 and the decision to make there and the decision is penalty against Sakamoto yeah, that's the easiest decision that we madly will have all afternoon and potentially all season it looks like a clear penalty the Luton captain takes the responsibility which he fulfilled against Sheffield Wednesday and he fulfills it here An admirably cool head, and Coventry, who have made by far the better start, find themselves behind. Yeah, real blow for Coventry, considering the way they've started, who never deviates from that technique, Hartle Morris. Morris fighting against all comers, Adebayo, and Chong with an opportunity! Oh! 
ten minutes. Horrible for the centre halves to have to try and deal with that. I mean, they're not taking it clean. The two centre forwards, Adebayo and Carl Morris, but look at that. The physicality, the strength, and keeping it alive. Chong joining in, and I think he probably just doesn't have his bearings there. Eccles with him. And Sakamoto to complete the job, but it'll fall here for Moses. chest in the end of Morris Kraus oh, beautifully oh, done oh, oh, oh. delightful the goals are flowing at last for Elijah Adebayo but it's totally against the flow of the game there's Adebayo on the mark but a young son of it to his strike partner once more Adebayo steers it enough towards the far corner, gets the little nick of the goalkeeper. And how much better will he be feeling after the last couple of outings? Lovely goal. Holmes not getting his timing right. There's a, a flurry of uh, yellow cards in the first half, and by the standard set, Holmes certainly has to join those already in the book the fourth Luton player today to be carded right broke kindly for him oh, so excellent run through the challenges yeah, determination shocking but whatever lets you down it won't be your acker it's a gaffer of an acker from Ladbrokes to pull his team back into this on show. Oh, yes. oh. to keep the pressure on Eccles will take it on he is not far away he's unfortunate catches it nicely brilliant ball in this is a striker's dream let me tell you lands in the perfect spot had you right maybe could have gone a little bit more aggressively lovely pick out as well doesn't miss by much, you could tell Kalinski is threatened, he's concerned that it's going to find the far corner, just spinning wide. This is Lata Baudier. Torp again, no change out of Marvellous Nikamba, but Van Evo can pick up the scraps. Sheesh. Will teed up. Compliment. Sheaf. Rudoni with Doughty for company. He'll go the other way this time. Sims gets up. You could 
Smelly. It's been a fantastic recovery from Coventry City and you've got to say that that man deserves his goal. Hedgy Wright, no question, he's kept going. Well, Luton might yet have one more chance. Clark, stolen by Eccles. And Wright. Sims on hand. Can they finish with a flourish? Kalinski says no. Opportunity to really finish this as a contest. There's going to be one last ball boomed forward by Kaminsky. Good pick out there after the initial duel was won by a poverty player. Swims on his left foot, not a brilliant angle, works the goalkeeper. After somehow at half time they found themselves two goals down, they had the weight of pressure, but Luton were clinical, Carlton Morris in the penalty spot, Elijah Adebayo getting his second goal of the season. But Luton, after a couple of hugely encouraging performances, were definitely second best here today. And Coventry, who started the day in the bottom three, have clawed their way out with a performance of resilience and character, and in the end, some pieces of real quality too. The final score, Coventry City 3, Luton Town 2. And would it you know, with that result, Luton now 22nd in the league after all the championship games have been played. Plymouth getting a point against Preston, Cardiff getting point against West Brom, Stoke losing, Coventry winning of course, and yeah, that's about it, subscribe, like, peace.